Hello everybody, welcome back to B10X. I am Narendra and today we are going to talk about the top 5 AI features available in Microsoft Excel. But before we jump into the depths of AI magic in Excel, I have something special to share with you. B10X is hosting an exclusive workshop on Microsoft Office using AI tools. The link is in the description. Stick around and we will discuss it further later in the video. If you are someone using Excel in your day to day job, let me tell you something you are going to be replaced unless you are integrating AI in your Excel. If you integrate AI in your Excel workflow, let me tell you something you are going to be 10x more productive and you, you will be getting that promotion that you deserve. If you want to learn all this, join me for my 2 hours workshop on Excel using AI. All right, let's dive into the top five AI features in Excel. First one is pattern recognition with flash fill. For this example, I have took one data set which contains first name, last name, then email address. So we are going to generate this column where we'll be having the domain name of the email address as you can see gmail and we have a hotmail also so we are going to get this call so i am going to show you how to get this first of all we have to fill the initial cells like gmail dot com then gmail dot com after that on home tab here you can see the editing just click on it under fill option you have to click on flash fill so you can see that we have generated this one So hotmail.com, all these things, yahoo.com, facebook.com. With flash fill, you can do this thing. Next AI feature is using Power Query, automatic formulas. So what we are going to do is from toolbar, we are going to select data tab. From here on ribbon, you can see the get data. Just click on it. So we are going to import text file. So from file, from text slash CSV, click on it. So I'm going to use names.txt file. I'm going to import this. It will just take few seconds. So I'm going to click on transform data. So it will open Power Query Editor. So first of all, what I want to do is I want to keep name as a header. So for that, I'm going to click on use first row as headers. Just click on it. Now name is header. So I'm going to add another column. So what I'm going to do is I want to generate email address from first letter of first name, then last name, then email address, like uh, email domain. For that, just click on from toolbar, click on add column here from ribbon, select column from examples. Here in column one, just I'm going to do the same thing. J Smith at the rate. 
gmail.com next one also c anderson at the rate gmail.com so you can see we are getting all the remaining values automatically just click on ok it will just take few seconds as you can see we have generated email address for all these names so to check the formula which our query used from right hand side just click on this thing settings icon here you can see the formula which our query generated just click on ok so from toolbar click on home and we are going to save this thing just click on close and load as you can see next ai future is automatic analysis automatic ai analysis i'm going to show you this thing so for this thing i have took this data set so i have sales person name then product column after that date then sales then boxes after that expenses so for automatic analysis first of all we have to select the data then from ribbon on home tab click on analyze data so similar to chat gpt here you can ask questions about your data so total sales of product c over date like that you can see it is giving us a keyword chart you can also see the total expenses by product as a column chart you can also check particular sales person so like that you can ask whatever the question you want related to the data percentage distribution of product so let's in, insert this keyword chart into our sheet as you can see now let's talk about the workshop briefly in the world where ai is reshaping industries mastering ai tools in microsoft office can be a game changer for your career ai won't replace you the key is to become the person who uses ai to their advantage if you want to stay ahead upskill and secure your future join our microsoft office using ai tools workshop learn the best ai tools to enhance your productivity and evaluate your career take control of your professional journey click the link in the description and secure your spot next ai future we are going to explore is recommendations for this thing i have a grocery store data set so on first column i have grocery items then date after that sales so first of all you have to select the data after that from insert insert tab you have to click on recommend charts so you can see there are different charts which excel is recommending so i'll select this 
पांच हंड As you can see, we have bread, eggs, milk on x-axis. On y-axis, we have some of sales. You can also explore various recommended charts. And you can also click on recommend pivot tables. So next, we are going to talk about our next AI future, that is forecasting. So you know, right, uh, weather forecasting, all those things. So we are also going to forecast number of installs on a particular app from Google Play Store. So here is our data, which we took, date, and then number of installs. First of all, just select the data. After that, what you have to do is you have to go to data tab from toolbar. Here, you have to click on forecast sheet. As you can see, I'll just click on create. Here we can explore this thing. So these are like orange one, orange line is there now. This is the forecast which we did. Lower confidence bond and upper confidence bond. As you can see. And there you have it. The top five AI futures in Microsoft Excel. If you are eager to learn more and supercharge your skills, don't forget to check out our exclusive workshop on Microsoft Office using AI tools. Like, comment, share and subscribe for more insightful content and remember to secure your spot in our workshop through the link in the description. We'll see you there. Thank you for watching.